Good morning, Richland High School. Thank you for viewing Ram TV. Today is Tuesday, November 6th, or 19th. Lunch, French toast sticks, and chicken fritters. Um, Tuesday, November 19th at 7 p.m. at Joel Penton. 7.30, ice hockey, boys freshman versus Ferndale. And 8.50, ice hockey, boys junior varsity versus Somerset. Good luck. Math club. Attention math club members. There will be a math club, math league contest after school today. RPAC. We love you, Conrad. Our high school Musical audition workshop will be held on Wednesday, November 20th at 3 p.m. in the theater. Any students in grades 9 through 12 may attend. Please sign up outside of Mr. Miller's office. Space is limited. Advanced ticket sales. Advanced ticket sales for Friday night's football game against Central are available in the main office. Students are $3 and adults are $6. All tickets are $6 at the gates. Theater Tech. The Theater Tech Crew Safety Class will be held today at 3 p.m. in the theater. Anyone or ex anyone new or existing in the crew who is interested in working and helping out backstage should attend this safety course. Please sign up outside of Mr. Miller's office. School picture retakes. School picture retakes are tomorrow. Forms are available in the main office. The District 6 Championship Football Game Fan Bus. The Student Council will be sponsoring a fan bus to Friday's District 6 Championship Football game at Mansion Park in Altoona. The cost is $8, which includes the bus ticket or the bus trip and the ticket to the game. All students must pay when they sign up for the bus. A minimum of 30 ri riders are required. Sign up and pay in Miss Riggle's room B108 by 130 on Thursday. The bus will depart at 5.30. Junior, junior High Student Council. Junior High Student Council members are reminded to see Mrs. Smych this week to pick up permission slips for Arbutus and Christmas shopping. Slips are due back on Friday. Key Club. In recognition of November's focus on the homeless and those in need, the Key Club is asking for slightly used coats, hats, gloves, or non-perishable food items. There are boxes on either side of the cafeteria. Please place your goods in one of the boxes. Our drive will last from this week until November 22nd. We can't do it all, but with your help, we can do what we can. Senior High Forensics. Attention all high school forensics members. Our first meet is less than a month away. Practices continue to be held directly after school on every Tuesday and Thursday that we have school. Please make your effort to come and practice your piece. GSA will meet after school Wednesday, November 20th in the library. Math Counts. There will be a Math Counts meeting on Wednesday in Mrs. Smyche's room B214. Air Force Visit. A representative from the Air Force will be in the cafeteria during period 5 on Tuesday, November 19th for any students interested. Sad. There will be a sad meeting on Wednesday, November 20th in the cafeteria during homeroom. Art Club. There will be an art club meeting or an art club and anime club meeting on Friday, November 22nd. Joel Penton Concert. Joel Penton will be performing in school in school assembly today. Joel Penton will also be performing a concert open to public tonight, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Admission is free thanks to the Fellowship of Christian Athletes. Scholastic Quiz. The Scholastic Quiz team is ranked third out of 13 teams in our league. Our team will be going to playoffs on Wednesday, November 20th. 2013 American Red Cross Blood Drive. The winter 2013 American Red Cross Blood Drive has been scheduled for December 10th. If you are 16 or older and meet certain height and weight requirements, you are eligible to donate. Sign-ups will be held during homeroom, and if you sign up before Friday, November 22nd, you will receive a free t-shirt. All donors will receive snacks and drinks. Teachers, if you are interested in donating, please notify Mrs. Riggle or Mrs. Dorch. Please consider giving the gift away. An Army recruiter will be in the cafeteria during period 5 lunch for any students interested on Monday, November 25th. Career Announcement, November 19th. Science that involves structures the size of atoms or small mole molecules is called nanotechnology. Scientists are exploring ways to use nanotechnology to build an artificial red blood cell, which could enhance many surgical procedures and may even be used for battlefield wound treatment. Most people who have jobs in nanotechnology have advanced college degrees in medicine, biochemistry, microbiology, or physics. Have, have a, a great, great day! day.